off my back. Let's talk about a reunion of best friends. This is like the ultimate, you know, for a reunion just to, to meet up to record a record, you know, for Shangri-La. In Memphis, I'm glad that I get to stay for, uh, till the end of the week. So we've been in the studio the whole time recording with Doug. And it's been just an absolute blast. I'm feeling kick ass. I mean, all the tunes are driving and Sherman's hand-picked selections, which I'm really digging the songs that he picked. I mean, it's just really kicking butt together. So step aside and take a seat. You have that line in unison? Yeah. Just follow it in the harmony. That's what I'm doing. But we both come back. The high one goes, ah, 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 ah. That's the top one. And ah, 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 like that. I know, but in the other line, I didn't do that. I went down. You're hitting a different. You're, you're staying up. So tell me what you guys are working on here, Mr. Joe Presti. Memphis. Kicking back the Def Jams with Doug Easley. Can I tell you a secret? <laughs> I told her in my shaky voice that I want you. Can I tell you a secret? I can do another part. Spending one hour is not enough. I really want you. Can I tell you a secret? I want to spend my days with you till the end. Now the first one I keep the same along with it, I just double it. And the second one I, I stay low because the other one's high. And we keep it and it really blends nicely. Uh, I, I think it was kind of soft. Uh, I'll do it again. Yeah, could you put the other vocals on so I could kind of harmonize with them? With a little bit of effort, I'll be fine. I will fly through the sky. You and me is so clear to me. Hot. It's freaking hot, I love it. That's what you want, so you figure it out with just two sweet souls. It's like a flat diminished twelve. Can I tell you a secret? I wanna spend my days with you till the ending comes. I wanna spend my days with you. <laughs> so the ending I wanna spend my days with you. Delicate betrayal. Sharma brings in these killer ribs like I've never had in my life. I'm from New York. We don't have ribs like that. And I was like, each bite was like, bacon every day. It's so awesome. They were so tasty. So that was my favorite meal so far. And uh, looking forward to having some soul food while I'm here. Memphis, baby. Yeah, that's it. You don't get that in LA and New York, huh? You know, just don't eat any bread. That's right. You can. We have everything. We, we did hot roll the limo. It's done. We hadn't roughed it. No, no, oh, what haven't we roughed? We haven't roughed everyone's Allison. I'll tell you this much. It's been the most amazing experience of my life. 
You like that? Yeah. To start off, because, and I'll tell you why, because I've been striving towards this musical dream my entire life, and finally, Sherman Wilmot from Shangri-La Records uh, noticed my drive at this songwriting thing, and uh, he's given me a shot, I had me come down to Memphis to record a record. And uh, we just recorded half a record here at Ardent Studios with Doug Easley, the famous Doug Easley producer. And um, it's been so incredible. My best friend, Pally, is on bass. He's right over there. I've known this guy since I was five years old. He flew in from Austin, Texas. How's it going, Pally? <laughs> to, uh, to lay down his fat bass lines, which I knew he could do. And I'm so used to recording by myself over these years. I've gone in the studio by myself, and, and then Pally comes in to lay down some bass lines. But for the most part, I've just been by myself. This is the first time I've actually had a real band sit together in a room and perform the songs, and uh, that's, that's what really helped them come alive. And, uh, we had this guy Steve on guitar. Steve Selvage, he's absolutely the best guitarist I've ever played with. The guy's just like phenomenal. He comes in here, he's like, whoa, this song, no problem. I was like, whoa. We had Paul on drums, who's been on an Afghan Wigs record. What's Paul's last name? Bukhanani. Bukhanani, yeah, he was great. And all the musicians that performed were just professionals in every sense of the word. And Sherman has Doug Easley, the famous Doug Easley, producing. And we're here at the famous Ardent Studios where Cat Power just recorded her record right here in this room. And that excites me because I'm a big fan of hers. And uh, this is just a great, great time. WNBA. This is the grenade. Oh, <laughs> yeah. GK style. <laughs> GK, GK representing Arden.